how are you? Yeah, I'm good. How are you? I was always wondering um, MNDR is my is my artist name and it's it's a combination of my name Amanda Warner it's my old DJ name so um, I was uh, really involved with like the German IDM scene, so very minimal, sort of warp records, um, abstract, techno I guess, minimal. I love the energy of New York. I think that's really generic, but it's got such a great energy, and you can do anything you want whenever. But there's something really great about LA. I think the LA music scene and music community is really creative because there's not as much financial pressure as there is here in New York City, which is expensive. Yeah, so. Um, I'm, I'm really inspired, inspired by heroines and also anti-heroes and cults, so I lived in the Bay Area and she's a very, like a part of the American like pop culture and uh, history and all of that took place in the Bay Area in Berkeley and I spent a lot of time in the Bay Area, like 10 years, so it was like one of the first songs I wrote when I moved to New York, so it was like sort of from my heart and by a heroine and anti-hero as well though. <laughs> well, it's, um, it's a comment on, uh, on aristocrats and like class systems and, and the history of feeding someone's diamonds is they used to do this when a group would want to overthrow like a tyrannical king and, and a way to kill someone, maybe I suppose in medieval times or the times when kings and queens were ruling Europe and Asia, you could grind up diamonds and put it in someone's food and it would eventually tear their insides apart and they would bleed out, but it would look like natural causes. And I thought like that imagery and really was where I was coming from, like the emotion of that and, and also my feelings about politics. So it sort of made itself apparent, but yeah.
say. Um, yeah, I, this year is really exciting. Um, I, I worked a lot on Kylie Minogue's record, so I have songs with her this year um, in Rita Ora. Also, Sean Paul and a Latin artist named Prince Royce. So, spent a lot of time as a uh, in as a writer and on the production side. And but I have a, an album's worth of material, um, and I'm gonna have a lot of new music this year, artist music, and also features coming out, and they're all. <laughs>